Recently, the popular democratic movement PDM criticized government for allegedly not providing a clear direction on how the economy would recover post-state of emergency. Projections by the Bank of Namibia are that the domestic economy would contract by more than 7% this year. PDM argues that while the coronavirus exit plan is clear on the social expectations under the new normal, the economy and related activities are left hanging. The economy should not be left wandering on its own just because in the hope that you want to protect lives. If you look at the amount of people that have died from COVID-19 in our country, comparing to people that are suffering from hunger, that figure could stand at par with one another. So there must be a striking balance. And we are saying we would have thought by now that government will have an exit strategy. So we are also going to debate our exit strategy in the National Assembly. Government adopted the four-stage plan in June and is currently being adjusted to be made public in due course. The plan includes the gradual opening up of economic activities, especially those which were prohibited to operate during the six-month state of emergency. We have those strategies uh, from early June, the exit strategy, and it worked so well. If you just look at all the components that were in, as adopted at that time, that's exactly where we are. With the lapsing of state of emergency, Namibia practically opened for business, including for international travel. But this would still be subjected to provisions under the public health and environmental health laws if the spread of COVID-19 spirals out of control. Blanche Gores, NBC News, Ventuk.